four warp cores. That's interesting. Redundancy. If one goes down in battle, we can still operate. Makes this more difficult, though. This ship can maintain warp with half the cores offline. We'll need to disable three of them. Where are the engine schematics? Uh, power flow routing charts. We're soldiers, not engineers. I thought you would know what to do. We understand how to operate it under normal conditions. You're in good hands. We can do this. I trust that you can. You at least know where we should start? This way. What are we dealing with? are running really hot. Makes sense, since they've been producing at max output since we left Hotari space. No ship can run for very long like that. Not before a catastrophic failure hits. It's right on the edge. We just need to figure out a way to give it a push. Bet that console down there could tell us a few things. Whatever we do, we need to make sure the Takan can't undo it. So we need a way to permanently disable the reactors that won't destroy the ship and kill us all in the process. You thinking what I'm thinking? Warp core ejection. ejection. So the question is, how do we make it happen? The reactor coolant system is operating at emergency containment levels. It's just barely keeping the temperature in check. Maybe we can use that. If it gets this high, their system considers a reactor breach imminent. The safety protocols don't look much different from the Resolute. Breach protection. Reduce output, command override. Cease matter, antimatter flow, command override. Emergency warp core ejection. Computer control. Even command functions can't override one of the most crucial safety measures. So the protocol's still active. That's good. Looks like... If sensors show a core is about to rupture, the computer will eject it automatically rather than risk a breach. So we need to increase the warp core's temperatures. If we destroy the coolant regulators, there won't be anything to keep these reactors from going over. And it will trigger the ejection. Let's peel these suckers open. I'll take that one. I'll take the one next to it. The second you two start dumping cores, the Takan will know we're here. Who'll be vulnerable? Stuck in one place while you work. We will have to make a stand. Do whatever you have to do to make sure we have the time to finish. Anything? Anything. We'll barricade the door. Work quickly. We might not have our tools. But our phasers can do this in a pinch. We better get this right. If we foul it up and this whole thing goes boom... We don't know how much damage that cartabula will do if we accidentally crack it open. Listen, the best way to make sure something goes wrong is to stress. Keep your mind on the job. We'll be okay. Yeah, we will. 
It's not a Starfleet warp core, but the coolant regulator has to be in here somewhere. up. Warning. Warning. Warp core output at critical level. Ejecting core. Okay. Now they're definitely gonna know we're down here. Warp core output at critical level. Ejecting core. Just one more to go. They're here. They're cutting through the door. We don't have much time. Okay, same as before. We just gotta... Shooting at the matter antimatter reactor. I'll cover you. What? No. Get the work we're done, or we're all dead. See you on the parade grounds of Sorella, my friend. Not 
You too. Calm yourself, child. It will all be better soon. Join the flame. To reclaim what was lost. We don't need to watch this. I do. I want to remember every moment when I make them pay. But this isn't the end. I will avenge Itasca. Swear to me, you will join me in this. How about we try to save her? That's a dream. I swear, we will make them pay for it. <laughs> 